Bonjour. In this grammar video, we will go over two prepositions of time, depuis and pendant, which are similar but distinct in meaning. In particular, both of them can mean for, but they are used in different situations. Depuis means for, in the sense of since, in the sense of starting in the past and continuing to the present. So, for example, j'habite à Johnson City depuis 2016. Literally, this means, I live in Johnson City since 2016. But more colloquially, we will say, I have lived in Johnson City since 2016. Note that in English, we use the passé composé, I have lived, where in French, you use the present, j'habite. Another example, j'habite à Johnson City depuis un an. I live in Johnson City since one year, or more colloquially, I have lived in Johnson City for one year. So depuis can be used with a specific moment in time, 2016, August, April 13th. It can also be used with a duration, one year, two years, six months, a week and a half. In either case, in French, you use the present tense, j'habite, je vis, je regarde, j'étudie, whereas in English, we use the passé composé, I have lived, I have been, I have studied. They do not necessarily mean the same thing in questions. So, for example, depuis quand habitez-vous à Johnson City? Since when do you live in Johnson City? And so a proper answer to that is 2016. Another question, depuis combien de temps habitez-vous à Johnson City? For how much time have you lived in Johnson City? And that, the correct answer would be something similar to un an. So depuis quand is looking for a specific date, a specific time, a specific moment. Depuis combien de temps? is looking for a duration of time, one year, two years, six months, and so on. So, depuis combien de temps êtes-vous à ETSU? A possible answer to that question, je suis à ETSU depuis deux ans. So here the question is, depuis combien de temps? For how much time? And so the answer is a duration of time, deux ans. And note that the conjugation of the verb is in the present tense. Depuis combien de temps avez-vous une voiture? A possible response to this is, J'ai une voiture depuis six mois. Like the earlier question, here we have, Depuis combien de temps? Looking for a duration, and so the answer, Depuis six mois, notes that duration. Depuis quand êtes-vous à ETSU? Here we have depuis quand, so we are looking for a moment in time. Je suis à ETSU depuis 2015. And similarly, depuis combien de temps avez-vous une voiture? J'ai une voiture depuis janvier. Pendant means for, in the sense of during, in the sense of starting in the past, but not continuing to the present. It is used typically in the past tense. J'ai habité à Paris Pendant trois ans. I lived in Paris during three years, or more colloquially, I lived in Paris for three years. The three years started, the three years ended, and they are not continuing to the present moment. J'ai habité à Paris pendant trois ans. It can, however, also be used in the present tense. For example, j'étudie la grammaire pendant deux heures tous les jours. I study grammar during two hours all the days or I study grammar for two hours every day. In this case, the two hours are not leading up to the present moments, but two hours that repeat themselves every day, beginning and ending. J'étudie la grammaire pendant deux heures tous les jours. Similarly, you can ask questions. Pendant combien de temps avez-vous habité à Paris? For how much time did you live in Paris? Here, what they want, with combien de temps, as with depuis, they want a duration. For how much time? Trois ans. And similarly, in the present tense. Pendant combien de temps étudiez-vous la grammaire? Here, the answer is again a duration of time, deux heures. So in the present, in the past, pendant combien de temps always asks for a duration. And so here we have some questions. Pendant combien de temps avez-vous été au lycée? For how much time were you in high school? A possible answer. 
J'ai été au lycée pendant quatre ans. Again, we have a duration here. Pendant combien de temps avez-vous nagé hier? For how much time did you swim yesterday? A possible response. J'ai nagé pendant 45 minutes. I swam for 45 minutes. Again, a duration. And now in the present tense. Pendant combien de temps mangez-vous tous les jours? Je mange pendant 30 minutes. And pendant combien de temps dormez-vous tous les jours? Possible response. Je dors pendant 8 heures. I sleep for 8 hours. In the present, in the past, pendant, in these cases, is always followed by a duration of time.